We'll still have a chance for spotty showers into the evening. We'll have a run of the mill summertime pattern over the next couple of days, but I am tracking drier air. I'm meteorologist Megan Borowski, at least over the near term, though, we will have to contend with spotty shower activity around 8 o'clock. Thunderstorms moving west of I-75, dissipating as that Atlantic breeze reaches the nature coast and we get into the overnight. Skies will turn partly cloudy overnight. Temperatures will drop into the mid to lower 70s. We'll have sunny skies to start off your Thursday. Temperatures pretty comfortable, though. It'll feel a little bit uh, warmer than this, thanks to humidity levels staying uh, high in the lower levels of the atmosphere. Those Comfortable temperatures not sticking around around too long because heat indices by the early afternoon getting into the lower 100s once again. Feeling like 103 tomorrow in Gainesville, 104 Ocala and the villages. Now we do have a slight chance for a shower or a thunderstorm again tomorrow afternoon. Actually, we could get a couple of sprinkles around lunchtime anywhere from Gainesville northward, then scattered thunderstorms along and west of I-75 during the evening. I will note that this model looks like it's a little conservative as far as rain chances go tomorrow. I think we'll see a little more activity than what this is showing. Our rain chances are going to stay elevated through about the first part of the weekend, but by Sunday afternoon, I'm tracking a pool of Saharan dust that should arrive to our area and decrease rain chances just a little bit as we, as we start off next work week. Notice rain chances staying elevated through about Saturday, then dropping to about 40% to start off the work week.